Hello, my it's it is Crashmaster, and welcome back to another Terraria Let's Play video. Ouch, bumped my head a couple times. <laughs> but, my it's today looks like we have a special guest right there. Someone named Opuni. Opuni. And, my it's the thing is, I honestly can't tell you. He's been just sitting, well, standing around, walking in this little area for quite a while, and let's go talk to him. Choose wisely, Crashmaster. My com my commodities are volatile and my dark arts are mysterious. Okay. What's that? Imbu Ying Station. Imbu Ying Station? What is that? Used to craft weapon imbuement flasks. Okay. Got a blowgun. Range damage is quite good, my it's 27 range damage. And um what's my What did my bow go? That's weird. I thought I um, okay, Mike, that's weird, but my, let me see, my boomerang itself does how much damage? It does, um, 14 melee, oh, wait, so it's a melee weapon, alright, so let me just go check my bow really quickly, where have I placed that? Alright, let me see, so my bow, is it here? Nope, 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 not in there either, and not near here, Mike, I could have sworn, where did I put my bow? Let me just see. Oh wait, not on there either. Nope. Okay. Um, there it is. My, it's my gold bow. My gold bow. There we are. And let me see. So it does 11 range damage. My, compared to the bow, this thing. To, well, compared to that. To compare to that blowpipe, this thing is like a twig. <laughs> oh, five gold. It's not that bad. Pure water fountain. Give me place. Desert water fountain, jungle water fountain, icy, corrupt, crimson, hollowed water, and blood water fountain. Okay. Kind of weird. I don't exactly know why, because is it good on work? That's a question. But for five gold, at um, weak knockback, uh, allows the collection of seeds for ammo. Thing is, do we even have any seeds? Like, um, five gold isn't cheap, Mike. Trust me. I know it just seems like five gold, but trust me, it is. Let me see. Help. If you had a gun, I bet arms dealer might sell up in sh Oh, okay, so I guess I'm our guide right here is telling us that we should. Uh, guide, can I- can I, can I please- can I please get my piggy bank? No? Okay, there we go, alright. Let's see, so we have- we have 32 gold, so I suppose we can spare just a bit. Alright, there we go, Mike, we got 5 gold right there. And let's go and get us some blowpipes. Alright, or a blowpipe, I suppose. Alright, there it is. Ah, there we go, mates. We got one blowpipe, so we have no arrows, so it cannot be used for, um... And there's Jay. Is that a new guy, too? I feel like he is. Uh, Jay wants you as the official Crash Fantastic World Errand Monkey. Uh, Oi! Hey, this is my world. You can't tell me what to do. But, I am a little bit curious. So far, I'll take your quest. <laughs> Alright. The demolitionist was raising Kane about losing a stick of dynamite in the takeout the, in the forest. He has like so many. So why does one matter? Apparently because it grew fins and started swimming away. What the heck? I don't know where he get his materials to make those things, but that one is clearly possessed. Reel it in and bring it to me. I always wanted a suicide bombing fish. Don't ask why. Caught in surface. Dynamite. So dynamite fish? So we need a fishing rod, I guess. So, Moitz, the question is, how do we make a fishing rod in this game? Let me see. Fishing rod, fishing rod. Uh, I really wish there was um. Let me see. Quick craft. No, no, no. Okay, let me ask him again. Maybe there's something I else. No, Moitz, looks like we do need a fishing rod. All right, this is gonna be a little weird. Maybe if I ask the guide. Uh, hey. Hang on to any bombs you might find, and demolitionists may want to have a look at them. Alright, so let me see real quick. Let me just look on my map. Scroll out. Let's see, as you can see, Moitz, we have explored quite a bit of this whole entire area. Let me see, anybody down in a mine or whatnot? No. No, nothing, nothing, still nobody. That's all of us. Alright, let's see. But still, Moitz, how does that make any sense? A freaking, freaking, um, dynamite fish. <laughs> what does that even mean? Oh dear, but anyway, we need a fishing rod. So, let me just quickly go on my phone really quickly. Let me see this. Terraria fishing rod. 
We're almost there we go. We got a Terraria fishing rod. Fishing poles. All right, fishing poles. All right, let's see. So to make it... Oh, there's a lot of fishing poles. Wait, I actually might have one, Molly. I actually might have one already. If I'm, if I'm right. Let me see. So it should be in one of these chests, I think. Fishing poles. Um, let me see. Sickle. Broadsword. Um, let me see. Come on, it's gonna be something. There it is, Molly. It's wooden fishing pole. There we go. 5% fishing power. Requires bait to catch fish. Really? Now we need bait. Alright, fishing poles are used with bait for fishing. There are currently nine types. Alright, I suppose. Let's see. Reinforced fish of souls. Uh, quite a few, actually. There's a there's actually nine types. Yep, so how do we make bait? Master bait. Um uh apprentice bait, blue jellyfish bait, uh green jellyfish bait. Um Okay, so it requires a couple different things. Glowing snail. Oh my god, this is um Boy, this game has so much type of stuff. I really cannot decide what to do now. Let's go talk to this merchant. I want to talk to some uh, friends really quick. So let's see. Mining helmet? No. Shurikens? Rope? Um, nothing as usual, really. The nurse? Nope. Honestly, to me, I feel like that nurse is actually quite rude. She is quite, quite rude. Alright, but well, it's anyway, the main purpose of the video right now is basically I honestly want to build some sort of Christmas room, even though I'm probably going to use that only once out of the, the year. Because, well, it's we have a pumpkin room, we have um, all these other types of wood room, and since it is for, well, the pumpkin room was for Halloween, since it's Christmas time, well, around this time, it's probably New Year, since that's the that's the day that this video is going to be uploaded. But since it is Christmas time, well, it's, well, oh, New Year's Christmas, whatever you want to say, I feel like it is best that um, we do build a Christmas room so let's see so do I have any ice let me see ice or snow we need ice and snow type blocks all right okay so we do have snow we do have a little bit of snow we also do have some candy cane blocks and we do have a bit of ice blocks so that is gonna be quite good all right let's see so we also did make this frozen chest before let me see frozen stuff oh wait Right. Anything else? Anything else? What about that? Is that a alchemy lantern? No, not really. Water chest? No. It would be better if I had a frozen chest. That? No. That? Mm, anything in here? Oh, maybe. Maybe some of these shiver thorns? Possibly? Um, shiver thorn seeds? I don't know about that, but I'll take it anyway. Let's see. Anything in there? Um, oh, right. We also did get some of these ice torches at one point, so that could be pretty good. A pretty good design detail. Alright, any banners maybe? Uh, not really, nope, not really. Alright, nothing in here. Um, nothing really in here either besides the Eskimo set, which we did actually have quite a bit of. Nope, um, nope, not in the pumpkin chest, definitely not there. Alright, let's see, so nothing in the drinks. Nothing here either. And no, so, alright, Mike. So it looks like this is practically all the stuff, and that's just platinum. So, alright, let's see. Let's see. What can we do with this? Oop, did not mean to do that. Alright, um, let me see. Take that right there. Torches, snow, ice, and that could be good for now. Alright, so I want to go to the, uh, let me go. Oh, wait, let me just go through uh, this one. Let me see. Any also, Mike, actually, there is a couple things I want to show you that I bought from this weird guy. But he just disappeared, Mites. I honestly can't tell you. So, we have a wild life form analyzer. Displays the name of rare creatures around you, and it gives us one melee speed. We have did get a, quite a few pumpkins while I was off camera, just to be sure that Halloween can stay with all of us a little bit. We have this bow called the Bee's Knees. 26 range damage, which is completely... This is still like a toothpick offense at all of that, which is when we um, defeated the, um, the Queen Bee. We also did- I also did find this, which is called a boomstick, which seems to be some sort of shotgun. We also did get this really cool sword called a katana, which is um, not as good, but it is quite cool in my opinion. Also did get these flurry boots, the pad tie, which I did buy one of, and a magic hat, which has two defense. So I want to put some of this stuff on, I want to see how this will look actually. Alright, the work can run super fast, and compared to that, what is the regular Flurry Boots? The work can run super fast, plus two damage, alright. So, is that, does that mean it's not as good, basically? Oh, it's not as good, alright. Um, let's see, so, where do I put some of, where do I put this? Okay, I can't put, I can't do that. Can I put it here? Oh, alright, I can't. No stabs will be game. Oh, that's, that's a shame. Alright, let me see. Oh, alright, so we can craft quite a few things as well. 
All right, let me just put this right back there. Pumpkins, don't need that. The pad tie, nope. All right, so I want to wear the magic hat for now. I want to wear the magic hat. Let me just do that. <laughs> there we go, boy. It's got a nice magic hat. Isn't that, doesn't that look nice? I actually do quite like it. All right, and the bee's knees, how fast can it fire? All right, so it's not going to be rapid fire, but I do quite like the sparkles with it. All right, so you know what, Mites? I think um, since we can't really build a Thanksgiving room, since there's nothing really Thanksgiving related, I suppose, I think it's best if we just um, build this area right above it, right above the um, the this. Oh wait, Mites! But the problem is, what happens if we need to expand this place? Uh, I think I kind of already have an idea of what I want to do. So you know what? It'll be fine. It'll be fine for now. All right. So let's just make this whole thing snow for right now, and let me just see what kind of blocks can we build. What blocks can we build? Ice torch, all right. Snowballs and snow blocks. Uh, frost burn arrows. All right, you know what? I actually want to try a couple of those. Let's see. It takes torches and it takes um, arrows. All right, let me just do that. And I want to make some more of those torches just in case. There we go. All right, and that seems to be... I could have sworn we could have made some more stuff. I could have sworn we did. Oh, right, the sugar king, the sugar king. Of course, we were near, uh, We need to be uh, near a workbench, so quickly, let me just do that. Oh, there he is, boys. Um, Openy, um, is, um, I have no idea. Honestly, I don't know who this guy is, what he's doing here. I honestly cannot tell you, boys. All right, we can make snow bricks, um, candy cane walls, which I think would be pretty cool, in my opinion. All right, also, this is that whole pumpkin set. All right, so for now, let's see, um, candy cane walls... Is there any way we can make, um, snow walls? I don't think we can, my honestly, I don't think we can. Let's see. So, I'm gonna make a lot of the... I think it's better to make, instead of snow, let's make, um... Or should it be snow bricks? I'm not really, I'm not really sure, honestly. Alright, just make, a, um, 90 of those for now. There we go. And let's see. Snow brick wall! Okay, you know what, Mike? Instead of candy cane walls, let's make snow brick walls. Or maybe we can make some sort of pattern. There we are. All right, back up there. Wait, nope. There we go. All right, so let's see. I want to tear this down instead. All right, tear it down, tear it down, tear it down, tear it down. All right, now snow. Not the ice, not the ice. Um, right there. There we go. All right. Oh. <laughs> no, not there. Not inside of there. That's a that's a Halloween room, not a Christmas room. This is a Christmas room. All right, there we go. Up there, up there. One more, and then all the way up. Um, or I suppose we could just do that. Oh wait, wait, we do need wood, mines. We do need wood because the thing is about that room up there. This room, it actually is um, it is quite a bit shorter than it should be. Actually, honestly, I actually did never notice this until um a couple of videos back when people were commenting about it. Alright, there we go. Got a little bit of wood. There we are. Alright, so let me see. Wood, 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 wood. We need... Yep, there we go. Alright. Place, um... Okay. Oh, oh, come on. Get, get everything in order. There we go. Okay, let me see. So... Let me get rid of this. Let me get rid of this. There we go. Alrighty then. There, that's better. That's better. Wait, is this supposed to be? Oh no 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 no! <laughs> Boys, I just I just put more back down for some reason. I don't know why, but I just did that. All right, there we go. Now all the way over here. There we go. All right, now put the wood. Oh nope. Let me get rid of that. There we go. All right. And see, Mites, now I can actually walk up here as well. There we go. Alright, now I need a wooden wall. Do I have any more? Yep, I do. Also, I do have, um, palm wood, which actually is not as much as all the other one, and living wood. But, um, leave me in comments, Mites, on what other kind of rooms or adventures I can actually go on. Because I'm still quite new to this game while planning for other videos, so I don't exactly have time for all the series. But this one, I promise, I will take care of and plan these videos much more out. All right, I should have it up. Yep, I do. I do. All right, let me just make sure. Oh wait, nope, a little too much. There we go. All right. Good thing I have all these climbing spikes and shoes. This is really helpful. 
I wonder if we can make some sort of snow door. Oh, falling star. There we go. All right, there we go, boys. That's the whole um, that's the whole exterior, pretty much the whole exterior walls. Wait, <laughs> nope. There we go. All right, now the snow brick walls can be placed. Wait, actually, before I do that, I want to get the torches really quick. Make a little bit of light. There we go. And there's another one. Ah, oh, Mois, I have to be honest. I might actually live in this room. As I actually might live in this room, honestly. Because it's all Chris. Even though it's not really a Christmas-ish room. It, um, well, I mean, it will be, hopefully. We'll see what we can make for now. Alright, there we go. Place all these down. All of them, all of them, all of them. Alright, a little bit more. Good thing we did make- good thing it did give us some um, 4 for 1. So, because if not, we might have to go all the way to the ice um, place. Like, um, the- what is- what is it? Ice biome, I suppose it's called? The ice biome, just to get- just to get a little more snow. Because, Marks, look, let me show you on the map really quick. The ice biome- the closest ice biome is- there's no ice biome all the way to the right side. It's- I mean- I mean, with my flurry boots, it wouldn't take that long, but- it wouldn't take quite a while, anyway. Oh, wait, and I just noticed. Drop that. And you know what? Just get the shooting star as well. Looks like opening and the nurse are talking down there. About what? I have no idea, and I probably do not want to know. Right, let's see. So, is there any way to make frozen door? Frozen campfire! Whoa, okay, you know what? I actually, I'm just gonna craft that. Just craft that right there. Yep, all right. I don't know if that's safe or not, Mites. I honestly cannot tell you if it's safe or not. But, uh, eh. Anyway, we're just gonna do it. We're just gonna do it anyway. Alright, let's see, let's see. Snowballs. What can we do with snowballs? Eight throwing damage? What? No way, Mites. No, that's gonna be a trick with snowballs. You've gotta be kidding me. Let me try this at a bunny. Let me try this at a bunny. It's gonna do nothing. What? <laughs> oh, God. No. It's funny, but it's so... Awful! I'm so sorry, rabbit or bunny. Oh dear, boys! I feel so awful, honestly. Oh dear, but I wanna, I want some mobs right now. I wanna see some mobs, honestly, because I wanna try these snowballs out. I wanna just see an evil zombie or, or something. Oh, here's oh Christmas zombie, of course. Okay, boys, look at this. If you keep spamming it, Crash Master defeated the 100 zombie. Okay, Mice, you know what? I'm actually quite proud of that. A hundred zombies. Whoa, okay. Get back. Get back. Or I will use my snowballs of doom. <laughs> oh, dear, boys. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. Ah, get back. Get back. Get back. This is actually quite good as well. Boys, I'm not joking. This is not a ploy or anything. Look at this. I'm actually pushing them back. <laughs> wow, that is that is just crazy, Mice. But what did... Whoa. I did that slime with a bow on it, like a like an actual present bow. Yep, and that one did too, okay. Nice, but I have to admit, this is pretty cool with the snowballs as a weapon. As a legitimate weapon in this game, Mites. I have to say, that is quite... No, we are creatures nearby, alright. So, there's not... At least we know... At least, I actually... You know what? I think that would actually be quite helpful, in my opinion. I think that actually might be quite um, helpful. Alright. But still, I actually might do this, even though it won't be Christmas for long. Even until like we always get into like harder bosses, cause <laughs> what are we gonna do? Um, bring like um the brain and I Cthulhu and the uh, King Slime and whatnot, and I'm just gonna chuck snowballs at them? No, obviously not. That's gonna that's just ridiculous. No. All right, let me see. So there we go. But if there is any like mini enemies, I might just do that for fun. There we go, my. Doesn't that just look cool? Doesn't that just look cool with the blue flames? That looks pretty cool in my opinion. Alright, let me see. Um, there we go. Wait, wood and wood. There we go. Alright, let me get that wooden... Wooden thing right there. There we are. Very nice, Mike. See, look. This whole house is coming together. Only problem is, is that, um, basically, so far, this hasn't actually, um... This is a little too short still. But I, I might fix this at one point, if I can. Right, let's see. Because we don't really need to um, jump up here, do we now? I only put this, um, so basically we can put more, um, more chests, pretty much. Alright, so, you know what? I think it's about time that we assign people to the room, actually. Is that possible? Alright. Oh, oopsie. Did not mean to do that. Wait. <laughs> oh, my, it's the buttons are so weird in this game. I don't know why, but they just are for me. Alright, the housing. I really wish I could switch menus right now. This would be, if I can remove that. 
Alright, so she lives there, he lives there, the old man lives there, the guide lives in the second room, which is a little off. And the nurse lives down here, which is, um, uh, okay, I guess. I, that's not exactly what I would picture a nurse living. And he and Openy is, uh, decide to stay, and uh, in the, in the, I think that's the, no, not the Emperor Wood. Um, uh, which one was that? Let me see. Let me see real quick. Um, it was the... The Ball Rail? The Shade Wood. That's what it was, Molly. And uh, this one... You'd think the nurse would live in, like, a red room. You'd think it, she would. I see. Is any way I can actually move here? I think she would enjoy this room much more. Let me see. So, housing. Right there. I want to give this room to the, the nurse. This is not valid housing. Why? Is it because there's not a second door? I don't know, mites. I don't know why it's not a uh, valid hi housing. Let me see. Second door, second door. Uh, there's gotta be one, right? No? That's weird. Alright, so, you know what? Wait, actually, I see a second door right there. Yep, rich mahogany. Alright, let me get a little more of that as well. Oh, wait! <laughs> no, I put it in the chest! Oh, Crash Master, what, am what are you thinking? What are you thinking? Okay, there we go. Oh, wait. Nope, I know why. That's why I didn't put it down there. Alright, right there. Now we can. There we go. See, and she's even sitting down. So, is she gonna do it? Oh, is she gonna be able to do it? Alright, let me see. So, there we are, boys. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Alright, so I think everybody... Let me see. Is there any chance we can actually move this on the merchant to another one? Because I actually think I might stay in here or the winter room, honestly. Unless there's like some sort of um, snowman um, person that will come along. For now, let's move the old man to, like, um, this, this old-looking house right here. I mean, not house, room. There we go, the merchant stays there now. Whew. Alright, or should I stay here? You know what? As my first guess, I'm gonna leave the guy to this, to this room. I'm gonna leave the guy to this room. Wait, what the heck? My Chris, the arms dealer? What the? <laughs> Where'd he come from? Where is he? I wanna see him on the map. What the heck? Mark, Marquis, Marquis, alright. So, I don't know, Mike. Maybe there's some other way I can do this. Who knows? But um, for now, I have to admit this is actually pretty cool. Cause look, we have a whole new companion on a on a with a, a whole new friend right now. Marquis, 250 health. I want what nurse is selling. What do you mean? She doesn't sell anything. Yeah, she actually does it, Mike. Let me see. A musket ball, seven copper, not bad. Well, it's for one. Um, a flintlock pistol. A flintlock. Oh, that's a mini shark. 35 gold? No way! Let me see. No knockback. Insanely fast speed. This has to be... Yeah, this has to be some sort of gun. Because it consumes um, ammo, obviously. Let me see. 35 gold? Mark. I don't even have 35 gold. That's crazy. It doesn't even do that much unless the... Let me see. Very fast speed. Insanely fast speed. What's the... 10 range damage, 6 range damage. But what does this do? Um, fast speed. Alright, but the thing is, I want to keep... I think this is better, unless the sailing fast speed is going to help me in the future or whatnot. But, okay, welcome to the to the, to the house, Marquis. Or Mark... I'm just going to say Marcus. I don't want to offend him or anything. Um, so I'm just going to say Marcus. Let me see, is there any way I can make a frozen door? Or even a blue door? I would be happy about just a blue door. Let me see, blue, blue, blue. Anything like frozen, mana, nope. Alright, so... Really? Can I not do anything else? Let me see, Moist. There's gotta be something. There's gotta be something. Like a blue door or something made of ice. Alright, um, snowball, snow block. No. No, no, no. Nothing, really. Maybe if I make some more of these snow bricks? I mean, there is the candy cane wall. That is something, but it's not really much. Hmm. Well, Moist, you know what? I actually have an idea. Even though it's- we're not gonna keep this around, my so if you want, in the comments below, before we end the video, I wanna build a candy cane just inside, just to- just to do something with this room. I wanna just do something, even though I can't actually go past it now, can I? Uh, kind of- oh, maybe I can make shapes in the background, my Do you think that would be pretty cool? Um, who knows, who knows? But for now, I'm just gonna make a little candy cane shape. Uh, okay, this is pretty bad. Let me see, I think I gotta break that one, break that one. Let me see, maybe like that? Does that work? I mean, that kind of does. I mean, without that. There we go. See, look, we got one candy cane. Um, okay, yep, I was gonna make a, a two by one, but um, nope, that's kind of short. 
There we go. There's one more. Oopsie. Didn't normally do that. All right. And we'll have one more right here. All right. It could be a gigantic one. A giant tall candy cane. There we go. And it's got an extra long... Uh, actually, no, that'd be too long. That'd be way too long. So we have one candy cane block left. But um, who knows, Marks? Maybe if you want, I could just do it in the background for like a, a more like the actual design. Plus, I mean, we do want to kind of move it in the... We kind of do want to move in this room. I mean, what's the point in a room that you can't actually even move in? So you know what? Instead, I'll take this down. And you know what? Maybe I'll do it with the walls. Let's do that really quick. I just want to do it really quick. Because we don't have much time, but um, I want to make sure that we can move in this room. So let me see. Alright, yep. Let me see. Candy cane, candy cane, candy cane. Come on. Oh, wait. No. Ah, we need a workbench. It'd be cool if we had a frozen workbench. I think that would look pretty snazzy. Alright, let me see. Okay, frozen, frozen, frozen. Something, something, something. Please, please, please. Ah, come on. This is ticking forever. Alright, there we go. Candy cane walls. Alright, there we go. Ah, there we are, Mike. Candy cane walls. All right, so let's see. I want to make um, I'll try to make at least two. I'll try. All right, there we go. Move this out a little way, really quickly. All right, so let's try, Mike. Let's try it for now. Let's see how this goes. All right, one, two. Oh, but it is quite big. It is quite big, isn't it? That might be a little bit of a problem. Ooh. All right, let me get the, uh, the wall really quickly. Let me just fix that. Wait, let me break that, break that, break that. And there we go. That looks like a candy cane. <laughs> that looks like a candy cane, doesn't it? Doesn't it, right? Doesn't that look like a candy cane? Ah, uh, no, it really does not. Let me, maybe if I shave off a little bit, right there. Alright, then get rid of most of that. Just repair it a little bit. Oh, wait. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. I'm doing this wrong. I'm doing this wrong. There we go. Alright. Now put it all back. Put it all back. Okay, yep. You know what? I'm just gonna put this all back, Marks, because that was a pretty shorty idea of me. Oh, dear. Okay, so... Uh, okay, just do that, do that, do that. Wait, can I put... I can actually replace that instantly. That's, uh... I was just thinking, Marks, because for some reason, I was just thinking, like, I must be going crazy, because you can actually instantly replace it. Okay, but, um, anyway, Smarts, I think it's best time if I just stop the video right now. So, yeah, just leave a comment, and I just realized I knocked off one of the torches accidentally with my pickaxe, so, oopsie. Gonna put that right there. But I think I'm actually liking this top hat. The whole video, I'm thinking, wow, this top hat looks really good on me for some reason. I don't know why, but it just does. So, mites, um, leave a suggestion on what you what you think I should do in this room. And this is sort of still enormously big. Um, if there's anything I should buy from any of these people so far, just giving you um, uh, um, a list of who I have. We have Guide the Guide, <laughs> Merchant the Merchant, Nurse the Nurse, She the Dryad, um, Marcus the, uh, Marquise, I'm just gonna say, actually, I think Marquise sounds better. Marquise the arms dealer, Opini the witch doctor, and Jay the angler. That's what he is, a witch doctor, alright. So, Moist, just let me know in the comments on what I should buy from any of these guys, if anything in this room you think I should do. Anything else that I should build in these rooms, because in the future, I am gonna probably do a little more, obviously, but that's enough for now. Hopefully you all enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe. And yes, Moist, I will see you all later. Later, guys!